Hello everyone, I'm Ala Jadi. Welcome to Music Greatness. For this lesson, I'm going to break down a Sunday kind of love. And it goes just like this. All right, so what I just played was the short bit we're going to use as the intro and also the first verse. We're playing in the key of C. And for the chords, we're starting with C major. Playing C on the left, G, C and E right hand. After that, we have A7 flat 9. A on the left, G, B flat, and E. So I'm not playing the major third here, only the seventh, the flat nine, and then E on top. So A7 flat nine. Then we have D7 flat nine, that's D on the left, G flat, C, and E flat, right hand. And then, coming up next, we have a chord very similar to the D7 flat 9, and that's A flat 7. So, A flat and G flat on the left, C and E flat right hand. And then from here, I'm going to go down a half step and play G7. That will be G and F, B and D. Okay, let's take a look at the beginning of the track. We're going to start with this very simple G7 chord played on the right hand. That's F, G, B, and D. And we're going to play that when Edda James is singing the intro, the intro line. So, I wanna... Sunday. So when she's doing that, we're going to play that G7 chord. So what I'm going to do right now is play the melody line on top here with my right hand and play the G7 with my left just so you can see where the G7 is played. time. So that's the start of the song, playing this G7 with your right hand. And then for the first verse, since the first pattern we're going to use on the right hand is so sparse, What we're going to do is double the pattern of the bass line. Only for the first verse. So I'm starting with C, and we have one chord per measure, then D flat for the second measure, after that D, and then G. It goes like this two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four. Five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. So that's our first bass line. And in between those root notes that I'm playing, so C, D flat, D, and G, I'm going to add some connecting melody lines. So after playing C, I have E and G, going 
going to D flat. So starting on beat 5, I'm going to play E, and then on beat 6, G. And first beat of the next measure, I have D flat. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1. Then to get to D, again I'm going to use E and G, and then D. And finally, to get to G, I'm going to use this chromatic descending line. So A, going down a half step on A flat, and finally landing on G. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And going back to C major, I have A, B, and then C first beat. Here it is. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1. So that's the bass line I'm going to use starting the verse. Now let's add the red hand. And the pattern is very simple here. We're going to use triads. And what we're going to do is play a back and forth between the notes surrounding the middle note inside the triad. So I'm going to start with the two surrounding notes. So for G, C, and E, the surrounding notes are G and E. And the note in between is C. Okay, so here is the back and forth. One, two, and three, and four. Simple as that. One, two, and three, and four. And the pattern will always be the same. You only have to know the three notes you're playing. So start with the two surrounding notes. And then play the back and forth with the note in between. One, two and three and four. So it starts on the second beat and ends on the fourth beat. One, two and three and four, five, six. So we're starting with G, C and E. Then over D flat, I'm playing E, G, A. So again, the two surrounding notes here are E and A. Back and forth will be played with G. One, Two and three and four, five, six. After that, we have D, G, A. So D and A back and forth again with G. One, two and three and four, five, six. And finally, we have D, A, B. So D and B and A. One, two and three and four. 5, 6. So from the top, 1, 2, and 3, and 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, and 3, and 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, and 3, and 4, 5, 6. And then we have this. 1, 2, and 3, and 4, 5, 6. Okay, so 1, 2, and 3, and 4, 5, 6. 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 One more time with the full bass line on the left. 1, 2, and 3, and 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, and 3, and 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, and 3, and 4. 5, 6, 1, 2, and 3, and 4, 5, 6. So that's how we're going to start the verse. Okay, perfect. Let's continue. We have this.
So here, the bass line goes like this. One, two, three, four, five, six. 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 So I'm going to play two measures over C. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then coming up next, I'm playing F for one measure, going to G. So A, A flat, G. After that, I'm going back on C with A, B, and then C. One, two, three, four, five, six. 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 Okay, now for C on the right hand, I'm going to play C6. That's E, A, and C. Same pattern, starting on the second beat and ending on the fourth. One, two, and three, and four, five, six, with E, A, C. Then we have C7. Same notes, but the A is raised by one half step to play the B flat. So one, two, and three, and four, five, six. And now we're on F. We're playing F, A, and C, same pattern. One, two, and three, and four, five, six. Finishing with G. Same notes as before. D, A, B. One, two, and three, and four, five, six. One more time. Two, three, four, five, six. One, two, and three, and 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 four, five, six. One more time with the full bass line on the left. One, two, and three, and four, five, six. 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 Okay, let's quickly recap and replay what we have so far. So we're starting with the intro. And then we have the first verse. Two, three, four, five, six. One, two, and three, and 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 four. Five, six, one, two, and three, and four, five, six, one, two, and three, and four, five, six, one, two, and three, and four, five, six, one. Okay, great. Now we're coming near the end of the first verse. It goes like this. So we're pretty much still using the same pattern here, and the bass line goes like this. One, two, three, four, five, six. 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 One. So we're starting with C, then we have A, followed by A flat, and then G. And for the connecting melody lines, we have C, E, G, then going to A, after that C, E, going to A flat, then C again followed by E flat, going to G, and then we're going back on C, 
still with the same melody line A, B, C. So one, two, three, four, five, six. 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 One. And for the right hand, we're starting again with C6, E, A, C. We're going to use the same notes on A minor. And then for A flat, I'm playing A flat major, second inversion. That's E flat, A flat, C. Same pattern. So E flat and C back and forth with A flat. Finishing with G, again, D and B back and forth with A. All right, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, and three, and four, five, six. One, two, and three, and four, five, six, one. Once again, one, two, and three, and four, five, six, one, two, and three, and four, five, six, one, two, and three, and four, five, six, one, two, and three, and four, five, six. Okay, now we're going to change the pattern and simply play root notes on the left since we're going to get a bit more busy on the right hand, playing this. So now we're going to use the chords that I showed at the start of the tutorial. We have C, then A7 flat 9, D7 flat 9, a flat 7 and then G7. And the pattern on the right hand is again very simple. We're simply going to play the chords and we play them on every beat. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. One chord per measure. So next up we have A. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. D. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And then to finish, we're playing A flat and G7. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So at the end of the verse, I'm going to play two chords per measure. A flat first beat, and then G7 on the fourth. 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, if you got everything, let's replay the entire verse, slow tempo. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, and 3, and 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 4, then finish one two three four five six okay let's play that once again a little bit faster
two, three, four, five, six. Okay, perfect. Now let's recap and replay the intro and verse at full speed. And that's all for this part. For the rest of the song, please head over to musicgreatness.com. As always, thank you for watching. Please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And for the rest, I'll see you in the next one.